shot. Leopard pattern. That's a bit kinky for a kid's game. Yeah, that's not good. Let's go for the denim. I like this version of the denim. It's got little apples on it. Yeah, apples are perfect. Never forget your apples. You can't leave home without your apples. Okay, we're at level 7. Shopping scam. Man, who the fuck would be scamming shoppers? Who the fuck would keep playing this game? Oh, it, it appears his name is Tabo. I thought I was Steven Universe. You lied to me. Shit. Well, he's coming with us. He's better than that little dog that I have on my... I've lied. That's twice I've lied to you, Brian. Yeah, meanwhile, I've never lied. Shopping scam. Oh, bo oh it's a little shopping mall. I'm Are you the liking... one who did the scams? I don't know, but I'm kind of liking the game's graphics. Monkichi. Yeah, they kind of remind me of uh, Animal Crossing. We gotta find Monkichi, Brian. What's a Monkichi? <laughs> it's a Mon. Have you, have you ever seen a Monchichi? No. Monchichis are fucking creepy, man. I don't think you could break boundaries by going up there. <laughs> yeah, this game is too safe. I I'm starting not to like the safety that this game permits. You know, you could always skip- you could always, like, turn the game off if you don't like it. Yeah, I could. I could turn the game off right now and have no regrets and play Wario World or something. But... Yeah, you could. You know, you wanted Hello Kitty, and I'm delivering. I didn't see Wario World on the list. <laughs> I promise. There, there was all those games, everybody, but Brian said play Hello Kitty. I thought it would be funny. We could have played Spongebob. Well, is the joke funny now, Brian? No. <laughs> it's not funny anymore. It's not funny. It was never funny. I don't know, I think this little screaming boy beating people up with his head is funny. Him? <laughs> yeah, his mouth is always wide open. Steven Universe, unless you unless you <laughs> lied to me about that too. Yeah, I, I think I did. It seems his name is Tabo. Man, you're such a liar. I can't control what Tabo does, man. I don't know why it's so funny to me. I don't know why I'm still playing this game. Oh, there's you a could turn it off any minute now. There's a monkey boy in here. We gotta save him. Oh, th there's no texturing on that monkey at all. It's all vertex shading, it looks like. They didn't even try. At least there's nice That's, denim. That is, te that is texturing, though. There's nice denim texturing on Kitty. Is this the freezer aisle? Because the ground is ice. Yeah, I believe so. I think we're in the freezer aisle. There's these dumb retards skiing around everywhere. <laughs> Whoa, we could destroy them. Yeah, you just beat their butts. Imagine those turrets had the voice from Portal 2. Yeah, imagine if we we're playing Portal 2 instead. Oh, we locked Tabo in the other room! We don't have I'll to see there. his dumb face anymore. Now we can just fuck this guy up. I thought you said it was Steven Universe! Well, guess it's not Steven Universe. He's not shrinking every two seconds. He's not changing his uh, look either. He's not crying. And he's not, like, protecting with a shield. Yeah, he's just beating people up with his big ol' head. Okay, so how- He's got it. He, did, he just did a headbutt. <laughs> I don't know how I'm supposed to attack this- Oh. <laughs> <laughs> he headbutted it to death. He did something. Damn it, Tabo. Classic Steven, always headbutting things. Yeah, that's his primary weapon. Because his head <laughs> changes shape every episode. <laughs> he just gets stuck mid-air while breakdancing. <laughs> that happens to me all the time. Alright, we got another loading screen. Fa fantastic. Everyone loves loading a screens. Beautiful game. What new weapon is unlocked? Oh my god, Brian. Finally got a new weapon. Okay, toy it's a toy hammer. hammer. That's the I need I need to keep using that. Oh, uh, is this Hello Amy? Yeah. Look, look at Amy her moving around in a circle. <laughs> Amy Rose looks different to me. Yeah, looks like a cat. Yeah, too bad it's not a cat. I don't want a partner for this level, I just want to beat the level. <laughs> I just literally put no on the partner. But, <laughs> you just beat the level with- Kitty's got too many partners. Too many romantic interests. Hello Kitty gets around. Freeze factor. 
You know, at least the levels all have something unique going on. I'll give them that. This isn't unique. This is just a freezer aisle times ten. Yeah, but it's a different room. It's not the same. It's not a grocery store. You know what I noticed? Like, I just saw Hello Kitty was all business. Yeah. That, rem that reminds me of, like, Fox McCloud, because if you pay attention to his dialogue, <laughs> he's like a dickhead. Yeah, Fox McCloud's all business, man. Yeah, like... We're entering Corneria City now. He doesn't say anything. He's got like no personality. We're entering Corneria City now. This is horrible. Something's wrong with the G Diffuser. Something's wrong with the G Diffuser. I'm gonna have to jack off. That's what he says. You should have got Star Fox Assault. We could have played that. I should have played Star Fox 64. On Nintendo 64. Only for Here Nintendo I am, 64. Playing Hello Kitty's Roller Adventure. I think this is a better use of your time, to be honest. Yeah. Is that dirt damaging you? You know, I don't even know if it's damaging me or not. You know it's damaging me? Playing this game for longer than 20 minutes. Yeah. We could have stopped, but you refused. We could have stopped, but... You know, once, once Brian requests something, everybody, you gotta see it through to the end. I didn't request it, though. He requested it. I didn't request you beat the game, I requested you stop playing this game. <laughs> you know, but it's opposite day. No, it's not. If it was opposite day, it'd be the opposite of opposite day. Oh shit, what was you got that, me there. What was that crazy jump you just did? Dude, I don't even know what I'm doing. I'm just kind of hopping around. It's hopscotch. That's the Hello Kitty way. Man. Dude, I don't even know what the hell to think of this game. I don't either. It is lame. It is I'm, very lame. I'll admit, I still probably would have played this back in the day when I had nothing to play. You didn't have cable either. That yeah, would explain it. Didn't have cable, just old VHSs and DVDs. And Pokemon cards. No, I sold my Pokemon cards. Oh. Because I realized those were stupid and I never actually played the game. I don't know who you are anymore, Cracky. I love the art of the Pokemon cards, but I never played the game. I used to draw the Pokemon cards, like, oh, like what sketch the fuck? The Pokemon Steven Universe has popped up on screen for a second. Man, they must be <laughs> advertising the new Steven bomb. Oh man, is it finally off hiatus? Maybe. Oh, imagine, oh. It, imagine if it did though. Yeah, random advertisement for a TV show that came out ten years later. Remember that happened? What? Remember, remember on Nickelodeon where characters used to pop on the screen and then advertise new episodes? Yeah. There was a scene where some important character dies in The Legend of Korra. And it shows Spongebob laughing and it says, Up next! Yeah, I remember that and it's pretty <laughs> fucked up, right? Yeah, and Korra looks all beaten up so he's crying holding someone's like body. And then uh, you know, someone did like an edit where Korra is laughing and Spongebob is like sad on the screen. It was it was the end of the Spongebob movie where they like kind of die for a second. Yeah, <laughs> that picture's yeah. hilarious. They also did that with the end of Naruto where Naruto and Sasuke... Blown off? Yeah, the end of Naruto, him and Sasuke hit each other so hard their arms blow off. How do they recover their arms? I don't remember. I don't think Sasuke or... One of them doesn't recover. I'm not quite sure. I, I, I it's forgot. Naruto. The series ends right there. <laughs> no, Naruto. No, he has a kid. The series most certainly continues, even though it shouldn't. And then there's Boruto. Yeah, it's his little boy. It's a shining young man. People say Boruto sucks, but I don't know. I never watched it. What'd you expect? It's a side series of an art, an anime that's already been on too fucking long. Like, don't they know when to quit? I don't know what to expect. It's like how Dude, you just let you just let that missile destroy you. It's like how Bleach turned into a fucking arena for the rest of the series. Like what happened to you, Hakusho too. I hate ar I hate any arc of an anime that is all arena. They did the same that thing with Shaman King, and that's how it ended. Shaman King. I remember Amitamaru. Yeah, I remember Shaman King. I used to read the manga because I used to get Shonen Jump. Yeah, we used to get Shonen Jump. And I'd only read Sandland 
Dragon Ball and Naruto. I would read everything in it. One Piece Wait, was no, in no. there, too. I, I used to read everything. You're right. I remember I used to read, um... Yu -Oh. One Piece. Uh, you, I love the old Yu-Gi-Oh! That was really fucked up before they started getting into the card games. Yeah, it was good. I love Season Zero Yu-Gi-Oh! Like, the anime itself. It's really fucked up. I have green hair. Like, have you ever seen an unedited episode that wasn't abridged of Yu-Gi-Oh! Season Zero? No. God, it's really fucking good. The music, the weird art. I've only seen the abridged <laughs> on the screw rules. I have green hair. Do you know what I didn't care for that a lot of people got mad about? What? I didn't like Dragon Ball Z abridged. It's kind of stupid to me. I felt I feel it's dated now, especially. There's no muffin button. I tried to go back to watch it because someone said this is so funny. I can't believe you missed out on this. I stopped watching at one point because it started just like making me cringe. Yeah, I remember there was a Sonic X abridged that was even worse than Dragon Ball Z. There was the Naruto abridged and that one was funny, but they stopped. Damn, I'd they watch probably a... stopped at the right time too. I would watch a Naruto abridged series. You should go look it up. Dude, I'd watch a Nutshack abridged series. We should do that with our <laughs> channel. We should make Nutshack the abridged series. Me, you, it and Nash will do the whole series. It'd probably get better views than games. Yeah. I mean, who's gonna realistically sad. sit here and watch me beat the entirety of Hello Kitty Roller Adventure? Not me. Well, I watch all our videos except this one. Well, it seems like you're already on your way there, pal. We're almost near the end of the game, I think. How would you know? I've got a feeling, and we're already at, like, what, the fourth or fifth boss? How many bosses have we fucking beat already? When did we? Oh, we you, you've been playing for like almost an hour. No, 50 minutes. I think. No, but realistically, this is pretty brutal for Hello Kitty. There's a lot of explosions going on. <laughs> you gotta be a real adult man to like this game. We gotta be close to the end already. This is getting monotonous. Nothing else is happening. Those bright pastel colors. This is such a manly game. This is absolutely the manliest game I've ever played. I mean, just look at that endless stride she's got going. <laughs> Always the stride. I gotta save the game. Papa's gotta help me save. Come on, Damn, take, Papa. Take me there, Papa Bear. Take me there, Papa Bear. And it's saved. Wrote contents to memory card A. Huh. Would you like to exit the house? Yes, I would. Yeah, do it. Exit the house. But also Can like you to... look at the whole map? No, I can't view the whole map. There's like a... Uh, I'll bring a there's partner a stage, this time. There's a stage thing on the bottom of the screen. Oh, let's, to... bring, let's bring the monkey. <laughs> it's a monkey king! It's the monkey. I don't know if you watched that old Jackie Chan. There was a point where they had this little Mexican kid in a masked fighter or something, and that's when I stopped watching. Remember El Toro? No, that's when I stopped watching, I think. No, El Toro was, uh, the fat guy, I think. Oh, the huge guy. I thought it was, like, Tofu or something they called him. Yeah, that might be it. Toru or Tofu something. Yeah, I, I watched I watched up to that point where one of the bad guys joins them. Remember, uh, the episode where he finds, like, a monkey with the symbols and he's like, It's a monkey king! That's well, my favorite. The only thing I can remember is that Uncle would always go, Jackie! One more thing! Yeah, one more him. thing! And... Yagwa wave me, hi me, thou! Yagwa wave me, hi me, thou! Is that when he would do a spell? Yeah, that was his chant. Yagwa wave me, hi me, thou! Yagwa wave me, hi me, thou! I miss that show. I only know that chant because Nash would not stop repeating it one week. Figures Nash would do that. He would call he seems me. Like the and I would be, like, not incredibly busy, but I'd be busy doing shit, you know? And I'd be like, what's up? How uh, did you call? And he would just not say anything and just go, Yeah, well, wait me, hi, me, pal. <laughs> that would probably get annoying. You just bonked it on the head. Oh, I saved Hamtaro. What's Hamtaro doing here? I don't know. We should be playing a Hamtaro game, not Hello Kitty. Little Hamster's Big Adventures. Hamtaro is the kind of cute we need, not Hello Kitty. This I think game... Hello Kitty is stupid, to be honest. Ugh, this game fucking sucks, man. 
No, it's this guy again. Can't believe you told me to beat the whole game. I didn't tell you that, I told you to quit. Oh, he's gonna punch this guy from behind, okay. Yeah, like the fat guys in Kingdom Hearts. Yeah. Okay, um, she's stuck on his head. There's not, there was- I was out of all control of the kitty there. Kitty was controlling herself. She had thrown her mind of her own. From, what do you expect from a Japanese cartoon? Those damn Japanese cartoons. They got minds of themselves. They do what they want. He really would not die. Well, he died. You know what they say. Nobody dies in anime. Unless they die. Unless you're Gurren Lagan. How come Naruto and other characters have been brought back from the dead so many times, but his dad can't stay alive after he comes back to life once? I think he wanted to die again, I don't know. He wanted to die, okay, yeah. Yeah, that's well, how it is. No, I think it was like they were, they were reanimated with, like, corpse and they didn't like it or something. Yeah, brought back know. to life, but you know, I don't want to be here anymore. I should stay dead. Man, I don't want to be here. Man, have you ever- No, you haven't. There was a scary episode of Ninja Turtles from 2003, and Baxter Stockman, I think, brings himself back to life from being dead, and the experiment goes wrong, and his body, like, starts decaying. And this was on 4Kids, it was a banned episode that they never played until, like, one specific marathon. And Baxter Stockman's, like, skin was falling off, and he's, like, screaming. And you see him, like, get nails and, like, bash his own arm back together in his blood. Is that car trying to run you over? No, he's with me. Oh, it looked like he was trying to run you over. And, also, that sounds gross. And the character Baxter Stockman, who was a scientist before, there's half a car here. <laughs> it was so in half. What the fuck? But in the episode, he goes crazy at the end, and the turtles don't fight him. They get, kind of get scared trying to save April from him. April does something, and it triggers a memory within his mind. He just starts going, Mama, it's you! And he just falls off a helicopter or something, and he dies. Again? Like, for real. He falls into the water. It's really fucked up and, like, dark. How did he bring himself back to life, though? I forgot, but I remember he was slowly decaying. And it was really gross, like his mouth- like his jaw fell off. Ugh. And I don't like that detail. Reminder, Brian, this was for kids. So it wasn't like heavily ed- I mean it was heavily ed I think no. you gotta break all the boxes. The it wasn't heavily edited, they didn't air it except for one time during a marathon. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you got- you got the battery for the car. They also, um... There's they, more boxes, too. There was a movie called Pokemon. It was like the Island of Mirage Pokemon. They only played that one time. There's more boxes right there. Wait, there Why was? did they only... No, to the left. Oh, okay. I can't describe because you're like going in yeah. circles. But yeah, there was a Pokemon movie. They only played one time. Why? I don't know. I remember they only played it once. And it was really bizarre. And I remember they had Misty come back in it. Okay, what on earth? Okay, what am I supposed to do? There was an arrow. Oh, oh damn that. it. No, I wasn't supposed to do that. Sure you were. No, I wasn't. Look, it opened the way. I do not know the There's way. There's an arrow. I was trying to say. Oh, he found a way. I'll just go through there. He like, he like ran into the wall. The enemy placement's getting stupid at this point. This game is stupid. Yeah, I don't know You're the why one I'm who You're the one who wanted to continue it. Well, you told me to play it, and I can't let you down. Yeah, I thought you would only play for like 20 minutes and then stop. <laughs> we had to beat you're the whole one, You're the one insisting that we have to beat it in this I episode. I can't let you down, Brian. I gotta beat Hello Kitty. I don't want you to beat Hello Kitty, though. I want Hello Kitty to beat me. You're already being beaten by Hello Kitty. You only got two and a half health left. I'm being beaten alive, Brian. Yeah, with a baseball bat. The adrenaline of the beating is keeping me going. I must continue Hello Kitty until the very end. You gotta talk to your car friend again. We gotta talk to my therapist about this. Eh. About this Hello Kitty adventure. Looks like you gotta go... You're gonna have to Dang. speak on my behalf because I'm gonna be against everything. 
You're not gonna be able to talk. Yeah. Did you just leave your friends there? Yep. I can leave my old friends behind. Is this a satellite dish, man? Yeah. He's taking the beating. He's just sitting there and taking it. He and took your car it like a bitch. Just like, and your car is just like, I'm gonna run you over. <laughs> this game is fucking ridiculous, wall. dude. Look at the breakdancing car. Absolutely fucking ridiculous. It is, but it's good. This game. You got an A. What else would you get? Yeah, how did I get an A? I was getting my ass kicked. I, I took forever I to know. clear that level, man. You did, but it was good. I'm at the point where I'm at the point where I don't care about the outfits. We're just gonna keep trudging through. Trudge on through, Frankie. Oh, arena of danger. How many stages could there possibly be in this game? Uh, I'm gonna look that up. Oh man. You know what? What? I'm gonna bring this monkey with me again. <laughs> no, I wanna keep that open. I have much How more powerful you... partners, but I want the <laughs> I found the walkthrough for this game. Cars are fucking stupid. How many stages are there? Brian wants this We're... to end sooner than I do. We're on like 10, right? Yeah. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. <laughs> There's 16 stages, Frankie. Oh, we'll have this beaten in less than like 20 minutes then. No, I think it'll be like a half an hour. No. You think? Yeah, I think. I don't know, I'm pretty confident we'll have this game beaten soon. The stages are getting longer though. We're at stage like 10 out of 16. Yeah, but they're getting longer. We're on our and way. And it took you an hour to do this much. That's true. You know what they say. About Hello Kitty. You know what they say. Old Elvis is back in town. Yeah, old Elvis is back in town. He's here to make his fried peanut butter and mustard sandwiches. I thought it was peanut butter and pickles. Hey, look, those two, those two characters are cute. They look out of place, but they're cute. Oh my god. What? <laughs> what the hell is going on? They carried me to drop into Andromeda. They've ascended to the heavens. <gasps> oh no. Is this is this a chase scene? It's the boulder chase, it's like Crash Bandicoot, but it's not threatening at all. What if it was like a mall teaser? That would a be kind of funny. What's a mall teaser? What a, one of those chocolate balls. Oh, yeah. Like Whoppers? That's what they're called? Yeah. Just like Whop those. Balls. I don't know why, they're like mall, te mall teasers and I see them every time. Let's all go to the malt shop. Like, let's head to the mall shop, Scoob! Oh, there's my Melody. Your Melody? Yeah, my that's her name, my Melody. You just like her because she's a rabbit, don't she's you? She's got little floppy ears. Ooh, I hate that rabbit! I hate that wascally rabbit. You wascally. Hey, look, a kitty. There's a grandma kitty. Okay. <laughs> did you just break the game? <laughs> yeah, I did. <laughs> Dude, these are speedrunning tactics. Yeah. Grandma, I found you! you gotta build up speed for 12 hours in order to beat the game. You gotta go to those creepy ghost children again. Yeah, we, ha we had to have a scuttlebug jamboree. You gotta do a half-A press for like 13 hours. I wanna do a half-A press run of Hello Kitty. Do it. Way. I think that would get our channel views if you did. Dude, I don't even know if you could beat this game without pressing A. Probably oh, not. Dude, that water effect is really good. Yeah, well, it was pre-rendered. I like how her little ear flicked when she saw enemies pop by. It was cute! Did, did I just oh. see a beard? What the fuck? He saved us. It's a marble. He saved our life. Oh, this oh. is madness again, Frankie. Is this... What is this? You know what we need to do? I'm not comfortable with those Hello Kitty upskirts. I'm not either. This is a children's game, man. But Brian, They're you like, said the levels were getting longer. It seemed like <laughs> it, yeah. That level was actually fairly short. That was a long level. What are you talking about? Don't lie to me. That was pretty long. Nah, that was pretty short. Project hmm. Home Run. Yeah, we're, dude, we're level 12 like out of 16. We're almost done with this game. I don't like being wrong, Frankie. <laughs> I don't like being wrong, then I love being right. 
But I hate being wrong, Craigie. Oh shit, we're gonna play some b-ball. Outside of school? Playing baseball with this dumb fucking robot. Oh, this is baseball, not b-ball. Same, dude, it's a B. B-ball, baseball, basketball, butt ball. What? They're all B's. Butt ball, did you say? Ball ball. Kitty, do oh. you copy? You must not touch the electric walls. <laughs> you that's think? Kinda ob yeah, that's kinda obvious. You can't touch this, man. Yeah, Hello Kitty's all business in this game. She's like, over, copy that. Oh. And it's like Star Fox. Yeah, she's all business, like I said, man. How do I damage this thing? I'm pretty sure. You probably gotta Jeez. hit the ball. Everything's so violent in this game. What the fuck? Everything's out to get me. Everything wants you dead. I'm just a little kitty. <laughs> I'm just a widow kitty. Oh, dude, he blocked you. I'm just a widow kitty, Brian. Shoot now. Damn it. Dude, do a trick shot. Like, bounce against the wall and then <laughs> into him. That's what I'm trying to do. I think it has to hit the electric fence. Oh, yep. Mm hmm. Trick shots. They're that the way. in the electric fence. They are the way. Hey, I didn't, even, I didn't even throw that one. Yeah, he did that one. Joke's on, joke's on him. Fucking idiot hurt himself. Look at him, he just doing it back and forth, not this moving is a, towards this you. This is a pathetic looking robot. That's the least threatening boss I've ever seen. <laughs> Can I just <laughs> boink? Boink? <laughs> boink! <laughs> oh, I thought I, I thought I could abuse that, I really did. It He's worked. seriously not threatening though. I mean, he could maybe try and move a different direction. He could do something then. Wow. <laughs> okay. He doesn't even try. He's not even trying. I'm just a little kitty and I'm trying harder than he is. This guy has got no soul. He's uh, a robot. Oh, I just skipped the cutscene. <laughs> you Oops. you clicked like A right before it even happened. <laughs> I was about to jump and avoid something because I thought I was about to get hit and we just beat it. And to I be skip. fair, that qu that quest scene came in like far quicker than I thought. That quest scene, Brian. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was trying to talk. The quest scene. I, ca I can't <laughs> process things. Well, we only got three levels left, Brian. Four. Yeah, four technically.